Lila had always been a curious girl, and she loved to explore the woods near her home. She had spent countless hours wandering through the forest, but she had always stayed on the well-trodden paths. One day, Lila decided to venture deeper into the woods, following a faint trail that she had never seen before. She was determined to discover what lay beyond the familiar paths. As she walked, the trail grew narrower and the trees grew taller. Lila soon found herself in a dense thicket, and the trail had disappeared altogether. She tried to retrace her steps, but she was confused and disoriented. The light was fading, and Lila knew that she needed to find her way back before darkness fell. But the more she tried to find her way out, the more lost she became. As the sun set, Lila was consumed by fear. She was lost in the forest, with no idea how to find her way home. She could hear strange noises all around her, and she was convinced that she was being watched. Lila tried to push her fear aside and focus on finding a way out. But as she walked, she stumbled upon a path that she had never seen before. It was a dark and twisted path, and she knew that she should not follow it. But her fear and desperation drove her to follow the path anyway. The path led her to a clearing where she saw a figure standing. It was a girl that looked exactly like her. Lila was confused, but the other girl told her that she was her reflection in the mirror of the forest. She said that Lila was lost in a nightmare, and she needed to find her way out before it was too late. Lila didn't know what to believe, but she knew that she needed to find a way out of the forest. She followed the girl's advice and began to retrace her steps, determined to find her way home. But as she walked, the forest seemed to change around her. The trees twisted and distorted, and the path grew darker and more twisted. Lila could feel the darkness closing in around her, and she knew that she was running out of time. Just as she was about to give up hope, Lila saw a glimmer of light in the distance. She ran towards it, and she emerged from the forest into the safety of her own backyard. Lila was shaken and traumatized by her experience in the forest, and she knew that she would never be the same. She never ventured into the woods again, and she never spoke of her experience. But she knew that the darkness of the forest was still out there, waiting for its next victim. Lila's experience in the forest left her with a deep sense of unease. She couldn't shake the feeling that something was following her, watching her every move. She began to have nightmares about the forest, and she would wake up in a cold sweat, convinced that she was still lost in the woods. She tried to put the experience behind her, but she couldn't shake the feeling that something was still out there, waiting for her. She told her parents about her experience, but they dismissed it as a bad dream. Lila knew that she needed to find out the truth about what had happened in the forest. She began to research the history of the woods and soon discovered that there were many legends about the forest being cursed. She learned that the forest was said to be home to an ancient evil, a being that had been trapped in the woods for centuries. It was said that the being could manipulate the forest, twisting it to its will, and luring unsuspecting victims into its grasp. Lila knew that she had to go back to the forest, to face her fear and put an end to the evil once and for all. She gathered a group of friends, and they set out to the woods to find the ancient evil. As they entered the forest, they felt a sense of unease, but they pushed on. They followed the twisted path that Lila had taken before, and soon they found themselves at the same crossing where Lila had seen the other girl. There, they found an ancient ritual circle, and they knew that they were close to the source of the evil. They performed the ritual and called upon the ancient being to reveal itself. A dark figure emerged from the shadows, and they could see that it was the ghost of the former owner of the forest, who had made a deal with the devil to gain power. He had been trapped in the forest, and he had been manipulating it to lure in new victims, in order to have company in his eternal suffering. Lila and her friends fought against the ghost, and they were able to banish it back to the underworld. They performed another ritual to cleanse the forest of the evil's energy, and they could feel the darkness lifting. As they left the forest, Lila finally felt a sense of peace. 
She knew that the ancient evil was gone, and she was finally free from its grasp. She and her friends never spoke of their experience again, but they knew that they had saved the forest and the people who lived around it. If you like this video, please give it a like and share. Subscribe the channel for more amazing stories.